Hello and welcome back to Transport Fever 2, the UK modded series. Thank you very much for joining me in today's video. And as you can see, we're currently watching the road trains bringing the coal, coal, no it's not coal, it's stone. Bringing the stone up from the quarry over to the railway station where momentarily, if I've got this planned correctly, momentarily a train will arrive to pick this up. Now. I have seen a comment in the last video, at the end of the last video, about narrow, uh, narrow gauge mining trains. Uh, I have been considering this. I have been looking at whether I want to put a narrow gauge railway on this as opposed to these road trains. And I'm still sort of on the fence for it. So I'm not sure if this is or is not certainly going to be a good idea. I should pro probably take a screenshot there. So, for now, I'm going to leave it with these these things. It just seems to it just seems to work on this map at this point in time. However, if uh, if a need arises and it does work, I will consider putting a narrow gauge mining train uh, in in the quarries and see what happens. But the focus of today's video is going to be these road trains. So. I just put them out in the at the end of the last video. I found them and I thought, let me just put them in. In this video, my focus is going to be trying to make them work, trying to make them efficient, and seeing if they improve anything, particularly around Bracknell. But also, I think I could get rid of a few of the uh, current horse-drawn carriages that are sitting around near Berwick Pond Tweed, the ones that obviously take the product. Of this of this stone which is the building material or construction materials whatever it is so I need to have a look at that I'm going to see if I can figure that one out and just see where it goes so make sure you stay tuned and hopefully you enjoy this video Alright, so first off, one of the things that I have had a really silly idea about uh, with regards to a mining train is what if I did not have two trains running? What if instead of this train running here, we had a tunnel that connected this quarry to this quarry and just everything came in over here? So that might be interesting, particularly considering this quarry will probably end up being, yeah, roughly that size. I thought that might be interesting, but I'm not going to do that uh, at this particular moment in time. Not just yet. Maybe at a later point. Also, if you hear my voice is a little scratchy, uh, I do apologise. I have a sore throat. Um, and it is causing it is causing a really scratchy throat and potentially occasionally coughing so you might hear some gaps uh, in, in this video like one coming up right now but hopefully that shouldn't be too that shouldn't be going on for for too long uh, the cough only comes every now and then although i've not been talking a massive amount so maybe maybe it will be a bit annoying today anyway let's get on with what i was saying we were going to be getting on with so as you can see we've got a a right mess over here now each one of these can carry five i could half the number of these if i replace them to one of these that could carry well actually two large wagons it's not going to be two large wagons, is it? Good. A double flatbed, there you go. 16. I mean, that is pretty useful. One. Yeah, that isn't going to work. Even eight, but 16. There we go. So, in order to do that, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to grab one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, let's go. 10 and I will sell them 10 gone that's made that much smaller and then these 
these ones here I shall replace with oh, we've also got that but this is nicer this is more realistic we had a lot of these as you can see I have seen these as a merry-go-round before hmm I was wondering where else I'd seen these obviously I have seen these in real life um, in museums and stuff in fact I've seen it on the road as well but anyway that's beside the point let's see if this uh, if this helps in any which way possibly I mean the, the other thing is obviously a lot of the um, a lot of the bricks are going out which is annoying because I would very much like the bricks to be coming in here now again I've been looking into this and I think this is an issue with um, with one factory trying to supply multiple towns and getting things in from multiple towns and it, it is a bit of an issue and unfortunately I, I just do not seem to to be able to find a way to fix it now I could I suppose bring this up to level 2 and see what happens or bring that down to level 2 should I say uh, actually level 3 is probably where we want it there we go this this could uh, potentially do something I'm hoping ah yes this is actually doing something okay so maybe if I maybe if you get to the right level it will work and that's in in theory should also increase production over here so instead of us having a train that has well empty empty wagons they should now be theoretically filling up uh, 270 it's pushing 270 271 it is going up how much are they carrying five okay ah here we go look at that that next batch was very quick that's a full 16 that's eight that's six that's seven that's seven now we could wait for this to to fill up uh, full loads but what I'm looking at here is how much is this going to have this has 83 currently the trains on its way back can take 147 let's see how much this has on this run will it get at least a hundred it has 112 116 trains coming in 124 that's a that's a far fuller train than it was before okay so we have progress there that is now that's jam-packed so this train clearly is going to need where are you this trains going to need more yeah because that's already completely packed and how are you looking two wait what because you've gone back down okay auto upgrade off bring that to let's bring that to level two and see what happens was it level two already let's try level two see what it looks like uh... now I think level three might be where it needs to be okay let's bring it up to level three and just leave it for a bit so what we're going to do is just leave this alone for a bit see what see what occurs what happens uh, on that now on this side we have 
a factory of course that is making goods and down the market se nope down the market seems to be handling that okay-ish but we could very well convert these all to road trains and if we did that that could carry eight so a small road train like that or we could have it carry 16 um, whereas currently they can carry five so let's bring it up to eight because at the moment also they've got a maximum speed haven't they what's their maximum speed hold on 9 10 11 12 12 12 so it's still 12 okay so we're going to have a so the increase in speed is going to be 25% no sorry 30% or 33% we'll have a 33% increase in speed and we are going to have a wasn't that just another 33% sorry and then we're going to have another 50-60% increase in capacity so overall that that should be good let's use that there you go let's paint them all let's do that as well let's paint them all uh, gold okay well they're orange now kennel failure be proud uh, oh dear no, I don't. I don't want to use that orange. That orange does not belong to me. Also, it wasn't the colour I was after. That might be more so. Uh, also, not the colour I'm after. I'm after some sort of goldish colour. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Gold, gold, gold. Can we use that? That just looks. Yeah, uh, I suppose that's like a deep. We'll leave it at that colour. And let's see if that improves... Well, I guess it cannot, because this is... This is maxed out, isn't it? This is maxed out. So we're going to need another train. No, wait. We have two trains. Right? Or do we just have the one? Hmm. Hang on. It's just the one. I think... This is going to need a double train. Although that being said, we also do not have enough wood coming through. So there is that. Hmm. What I could also do I have a really bad idea about these freight stations where if if I were to create a um, if I were to create another another platform on this side what I could do excuse me what I could do is have a train come in and then wait and just say wait for a full load so the other train could come in and it may not pick up everything I, I don't know it would then allow two trains to be in at the same time but then that being said they're not continuing in that direction so it doesn't really matter I suppose it's a difficult one it really is a difficult one uh, to to think about also, this is just overflowing as well, so how, how quickly can I get these now? Alright, let's have a look at the speed of these trains. They, they're probably going as fast as they possibly can, right? How fast are you going? 40. How fast can you go? 40. 
Right, you are stuck, so you are limited. That is maximum speed. Is there any anywhere else we could get wood from? Well, there is there. I mean, technically, this is a forest. We could very well take wood out from here as well, should we wish. I can make that bridge here. I I could I could redesign this to be a bridge, just like I did. Uh, just like I've done. Somewhere here. Where have I done it? Um, ah, somewhere here. There it is. Just like I've done here, I could redesign this bit to have the same. Hmm. Okay. Now, now we're overloaded. There. That's running it's it's running at a limit this is this is very much limited but what i could do and i think it is going to be a good idea is i clone that vehicle and then what i will do oops is say manage line load hang on turn back although that probably is a full load but I'm, I'm going to say full load with a maximum stop time of three minutes that will do now once once I put the departure thing in the departure manager whatever it's called the timetable mod uh, that will obviously change how things run and how things work but that might help there somehow I've got to get fruit fruit food down to Croydon but also I need to get bricks down to Croydon now I could theoretically I could do that I could bring them in right here bring them in here have them picked up and then transported into Croydon if, if we can get this bricks, these bricks working, because at the moment this is just not happening. It just does not seem to be fast enough. And that's a full train. I think these trains are now always going to be full. So the only thing I could now do is either double track this one and try to try to increase this that's theoretically that could work I've got the ability to double track this and just say come along in here and do something let's do that let's double track this so we are really going to need a lot going on here now and the other thing I could do of course should I want to uh, is make this much bigger uh, make the make the track much longer a uh, station sorry it's a track definitely meant station there definitely meant station okay uh how much although this does have i do have the ability to increase this let's let's start with that um what's the what's it like right now manage vehicle in a pretty poor condition that's okay though edit so what cargo wagons do we now have we've got those that's not going to work we still have these we've got the tramway wagons yes 
these are the uh if you want to do the little stuff i do not think i've got the railways for it unfortunately um hmm all purpose wagon top speed 29 that's not going to work i need something that's going to have let's find one with a nice top speed and work backwards from there uh right i think we're still stuck with these Okay, that's a longer train. Make that even longer still. Yeah, let's start by doing that. So these this road train is, is really helping here, it seems. Uh let's have a couple more of those and then oh that might actually be too long but I'll, I'll check i'll check in a moment if it is too long I'll, I'll just have to deal with it no that is not too long okay could you perhaps turn around and actually pick up the cargo you're supposed to pick up thank you so now we've got the ability to carry 189, which is still not a lot. So a second train may still be needed, but I think I think these trams, these uh, sorry, these these road trains are really doing a good job. I wish I could offload faster. They could offload faster. I've just had a I've just had an idea. Is this going to work? I'm going to try it here. But if I change that to two platforms. Is that not working? Make that longer. Did that not work? I'm not sure if that is working. Uh, that that doesn't seem to be working. Okay, didn't work there. Let's try it down here. Ah, the reason being, what I'm what I'm trying to do. This has changed. What have I done? I do that. Does that actually give it two platforms? Don't know. The reason the reason I'm trying this is because if possible No, it's just got the one platform. Um, if possible, I could get them to move to the different platforms, and that would be an even faster transfer of goods. Although, that being said, the transfer of goods is happening extremely quickly, so maybe that's not such a good idea. But certainly, I think... I think we could be in a good position. Uh, for this to work. Let's go ahead and uh, clone that vehicle and find out where on earth this one's coming from. Here it is. Where exactly are you? Oh, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Okay. I like the whistle you had. Can I press that again? That's a nice whistle. Cool. Let's uh, stay on board. Yeah, let, let, let's stay on board for a bit. So it might be nice. As it pops out at 10 miles per hour. Actually, it's, it's 
suppose it's not often you're going to see. Oh, that is the entire length. Of course, it's 200 meters, isn't it? As I say, it is not often you will see a freight train going through a passenger station like this. So I would like to make sure that I capture this moment. Let's use a bit of framing here to, to capture this nicely. There we go. I know that I know the title of this this episode is going to be road trains, but still, uh, this is it's also important. This is also important. I might go ahead and uh, do something here for for the sake of uh, how do I edit trains for the sake of. Um, making each train look a little different I shall do this I'll, I'll do this then we've got all these at the back so I shall get rid of some of these in fact I'll just get rid of some random ones here we go, and then this one maybe it has a lot more of those, and then oh, like that back. Uh, and where's that one? That'll do. There you go. Same size, but just looks a, a little different now. This gives it a bit more sort of character, I guess. Yes, the road train is obviously it's, it's the it's the driving factor, the driving force behind all of this now changing, uh, and that that is important. This train's actually doing quite nicely. Obviously, it's going to be holding up traffic, unfortunately, but um, hopefully not for long. I'm, I'm hoping that. I'm hoping it doesn't hold up traffic for too long. I can see the trains racing out behind, though. There comes another. There comes one that should that should clear. And then obviously there are ones stopping at stations. Hopefully that one is a stopping service. This is not a stopping service, right? You are going to be held because you're doing 43 already. You are now catching. You are most certainly not going very fast come to the station as quickly as you can any trains down here nothing it's a good junction that it just looks quite nice where's that train there it is no it isn't here it comes still on its way in although I think it had to stop it did but that's fine because now it's going to make its way through the platform it can make its way up to well by the time it's it is here this train will be past this so actually it has not gone terribly it really has not gone too terribly still a little concerned about the height of this uh, viaduct but really given the the way the hills are here so much we can uh, do one of the things I have been looking at is rivers sprawling through this but it's really hilly and I'm, I'm just not sure how to pull it off if you have any ideas please do let me know uh, leave a comment and let me know right this should now be swapping tracks there it goes it's not as high speed as uh, a track swap as as you may think. Remember, I am going really fast. And then we get stuck in traffic. Okay, but that is fine. That is absolutely fine. I'm hoping that that will enable this, which is already 257, so we are well above what even a second train could bring. And that is kind of a important ah 
now we've got a problem. What's this waiting for free path malarkey about? Oh, I see. Why don't you go down to the end? Just thinking about this line, why does this line not go down to the end? It does. So why have you stopped here if this line goes all the way to here? Oh wait, which platform is this? That's three, is that two? Oh, that's going, that's going to be a bit messy, isn't it? Right, so you have picked up 180... Oh, whoa, wait, what? Why do we have 187 and 189? What have I done? I've cl clearly, I've done something. I've done something here, but... And that still has 200... Yes, this is working. This is important. This is really important. And then let's have a look at the road trains over here. How are you lot doing? Still terribly. Why are you doing so terribly? Is it because we're, we're once again... We are once again out of... Um, out of resources. Now this is where... This is where things could be interesting. I think I shall have to rework... I think I shall have to rework this. To perhaps open up these these additional platforms for drop-off. I think that is something I'm going to have to do. But that is for another that is for another video. We we are getting towards the end of this one. I just want to see how quickly all of this is going to work. How much are you full? No, yeah, five of eight. Okay, but now now we have a fair amount of Oh what's happened here? Oh I see. I see the problem. Uh, there you go. Do that. Do that and have a signal there. Go on, go across. Come on. How can you not do that? Look. Look, look. Can you not see that path? Oh dear. Wait. Um, hmm. Okay. I guess... I guess I'm opening this, this line a lot earlier? Maybe? Maybe not? I, hmm. What has happened? I cannot understand why it cannot come along here, come along here, and then back over and in. I see no problem with this. Waypoints, waypoints, waypoints. Let's try, let's just try one. Your path shall lead you. Just want. This one, no. Manage line, yeah, add stations. Are you now going to work? What on earth? I am... I'm confused. And you did what for why? 
which Beric stone one which is not in the right place because you are at the wrong platform could that work I am very confused I am very confused right now as to what's just happened I'm just hoping that this does not cause a total failure in, in this. Well, where are you going? Surely you're not going to be able to cross over now, so... Okay, we apparently have Contraflow. Great. Um, sure. I will... Right, I'm just going to let that get on with whatever it's doing, because I have no idea what it's doing. Have a look at this and see that we have another full train's worth already. In fact, do we have more than a full train's worth? We have more than a full train's worth already. Okay, I'll leave that where it is. And to end this video, I'm going to replace the road trains that are coming in and out of uh, Maxfield. Or these, these that are coming in and out of Maxfield. I'm just going to give them... Well, we're going to increase their speed, obviously. Uh, replace. Cargo. Road train. Uh, let's do that. Double flatbed. Why not? There we go. They're very yellow, they are. Right, that, I wonder how that's going to impact the, these. Con forth, manage, replace. Let's do single flatbed. There we go. Just curious as to how this is going to, how this is going to work. And then, up here, we'll do the same. Single flatbed. I think what I would do is I'll use double flatbeds outside of the cities. Or if it's coming from another city and single within, maybe? Let's see if that makes any impact on this. It might, it might not. I, I truly do not know. And I might have to resort to to doing um, to using something that just produces food outright uh, to to help this move along just for the sake of again for content which is something I think I tried uh, but it just seems like there's just some sort of issue uh, with with the logic in this unfortunately I cannot I cannot figure it out so there's, there's plenty of food. As you can see, there's plenty of food being produced. And there's plenty being delivered. Or well, there should be plenty being produced. There's plenty being delivered. Oh dear. Right, I need to fix this before we end. What is going on? Right. You... So if you're going to be here and then come in to this platform, what's happened here? What what have I done that's completely and utterly messed this up? You're fine, right? I tell you what, you're a smaller. Yeah, you're. You let me manage this line. Why don't you just go into platform one? Okay, just as a sort of a temporary thing. And then you can get on your way and then the other train will work and then... Yeah, I, I think I need to redo this, this freight area. 
Care to chase it out? Please? 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 Are you not going to move? Please? There we go. Why are you half full? What's happened? Why is everything just falling apart suddenly? Wait, what just happened? Was that that one bit being stuck that caused that? Is that how sensitive this is? Now what are you waiting for? Oh, you're waiting for that clearance. I see. I see a, I see the problem here. Let's do a... Let's do one of these. Oh, and since, whilst we're here, let's do... um. Let's put that crossing on. Crossing. There we go. Crossing. Just for bit of completion sake there. I know there's more that would need to be done here, but that might keep that running and open. This is still very full, but this is going to be a difficult one to to work out. These fences, I'm just annoyed these fences do not show up from this level because at this level it just looks weird with all this just looking like this. Okay, any improvement on this? Uh, no. Any improvement? Not there. Any improvements up here? No, no, now we're just jammed. What? How is that possible now? What is waiting for what? Never mind. I know the problem. I'm not very smart. I know the problem. Let's perhaps put a real thing on this. That might help. I don't think this can carry food. I think that's what I've just done. Yep, that cannot carry food. Oh dear. Oh dear me. Which means I've just made a hash of this. Well done, brain. And thank you to the person who might have been shouting that out in the comments. Okay. Now we've got some. Now we've got something, right? Uh, I will. I will take a screenshot here because clearly, this has. This is, the ideal screenshot. Road train. Literally. There we go. Road trains. With a, with a train in the background as well. Oh dear, oh dear. I, yeah, I've, I've really made a, I made a hash of that. But that is where I'm going to end this video. So thank you very much for watching. Things are now happening once again. Yep, things are now happening. Hopefully everything will stop coming back together there. Um, Please remember to hit the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to the channel for more videos on Transports Fever 2, the UK modded series. I shall try to have my sore throat recovered by the next um by the next episode. I'm not going to record one straight after. So I'll give my throat a little bit of time to rest. Plus I have other things that I do need to record. So maybe not quite so much rest as it deserves or it needs. If you can do so, please do consider supporting me on Patreon at www.patreon.com slash ecgadget. Your support would be massively appreciated. It would really, really help me out. And also, you can find me on social media at ecgadgetlp for both Twitter and Instagram. How are things going here? Poorly. Very poorly. Uh, train's kind of got something. Hmm.
Mm. That is all from me, and I'll see you next time in Transport Fever 2, the UK modded series where now I have to figure out what did I do wrong? Why is this, why is this suddenly collapsed after doing so well? What on earth happened? What's this one? Is literally overflowing. Ah, uh, the economy in this is a little bit mess. Oh, sorry, I say the economy, sorry. The logistics in this is just a little bit, just a little bit messy. I'll see you next time.